Okay, welcome back to the Untitled Show. We probably have a medium to long episode this week, I feel, but I don't know, maybe. Uh, what do we got? We got this Nintendo uh, sound clock alarm, a little bit of uh, backstory on Discord, and uh, what? Ikeville event and banner, and then some sand rock. And Pathy, no, oh, Sandrock and Evershine stuff, I think. Hopefully, we can uh, do it in that order, but we'll see before you do that. See how uh, this goes. Yeah. Well, we'll start with your weeks. Uh, what about you, Gabs? How's your week been? It's, it's just been hell at work, but other than that, it's been pretty normal week. So. Is your all your papers and stuff done? No. Oh, those ones were due last week, but yes, I got them done in time. So. Oh, yeah. Nice. So once you're done, like, do you just take a full day off to do nothing? Or do you even have that time to do that? Uh, so, well, when I, on that day, no, I didn't, I didn't have any time left, really. But my last assignments are due in two weeks. And then after that, I'm good until the end of February. Oh, shit. That's a pretty big gap. Got, yeah. Got a bunch of games lined up or what are you going to do? Probably right. <laughs> okay. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> uh, what about you, Val? How's your week been? been I've been suffering with work. <laughs> the stupid fucking stamp promotion thing. And then also the fact that it's almost Thanksgiving here in Canada. It's been busy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thanksgiving. Yeah. I, I look forward yeah, to Thanksgiving. Thanks- like way earlier than America. Yeah. I was just going to use that to game. Cause I don't, I don't really have that many dinners and stuff to what go to. What is that thankful <laughs> for? Games. Games. <laughs> <laughs> We're just gonna grind out my whole Thanksgiving weekend. It's gonna be great. But yeah, dude. I'm not doing anything with family either, so it's gonna be a chill weekend. Yeah, or sucks. not chill weekend, just chill day. The whole weekend itself is gonna be a fucking nightmare because of work. <laughs> yeah, it sucks. You like at the end of the. Marvel collab stamp that you're like, yes, I'm free. And they're like, well, we're going to introduce this new stamp program. <laughs> you're like, fuck my life. Oh, I actually did have some. Uh, I did have something about that. Oh, actually, never mind. This is something else. They did talk about yeah. your stamp program on the this forum and people were not liking it. <laughs> but That's uh, valid. yeah, uh, we'll just get into some of the quick stuff before we get to the longer stuff i guess bam okay it appears i think they announced this today uh at least that's two days ago hmm interesting nintendo sound clock alarmo it's like the name sounds kind of weird and it said it's 100 american because i think they posted this in canada it's 130. Shit. someone needs to explain to me why an alarm clock is worth that much money it looks all right though right it has like this thing link needs on it. to like a hand needs to come out of this and slap me in the face for it to be worth a hundred dollars. Yeah. Seen, have you seen the trailer yet, Nat? No, there's a trailer. Um, yeah. If you just scroll down. The fuck do you need a trailer for an alarm clock? Oh damn! <laughs> it says playback cannot. Yeah, well, we've, we can get around that. All right. It's five minutes long. Is it? okay. We're gonna like maybe skim through this a bit, okay? Uh this is Nintendo Sound Clock Alarmo, an interactive alarm clock that's out of the ordinary. I hate it's a hundred dollars. That's what that's see what it's like to wake up with Alarmo. <laughs> it's not as bad as I. Do you hear that? Imagined it. The alarm is going. It off. gets worse. But <laughs> Alarmo doesn't just play music to start your day. Fucking shut up! <laughs> That's right. It responds to your movement. Your movement with game sounds. No way. <laughs> so it's like literally <laughs> watching you. I hate that. Odyssey. I don't My know. I would set it off. <laughs> uh, do you have to connect to this? Oh, it's Splatoon. No. Yeah, you can only get this if you have a split. with the sound um, of ink splats from Splatoon online. Three. Huh. So you gotta pay a hundred dollars and then you gotta pay a yearly subscription on top of that. 
Yeah, th th that's how they kind of do it, though. They even have the... If you wanted to buy the controllers, you have to be part of the subscription service, too. I think it's to prevent scalpers or reduce. I don't know if I like this, though. I don't. When you get out of bed, buy five Is this games. literally all it is? Uh... Oh, no, wait. Um, hold on. Go back to real. Hence, the longer they have a it fucking... takes for you to get up. What? So, yeah, they have a fucking Bowser mode! <laughs> if, if you don't get up in time uh, for the music, they have a warning. You can set an alarm inspired by uh, five games. I don't know. This is... See, for oh. me, I have an alarm, right, that I've used for years. Mm -hmm. the same the same alarm sound on my phone and now if that alarm sound goes off my dog goes absolutely feral so there is a guarantee i will be away <laughs> so i don't need a hundred dollar <laughs> oh actually i like i like the sound of mine but it has become a thing that it's become a thing that i hear that sound it's time to get up <laughs> i'm posting a link to mine <laughs> oh no i downloaded this and this is the sound i have I hate this. I hate this. <laughs> How does Liz feel about this? <laughs> I think they're fucking with it. Oh my god! Wake the fuck up, you lazy fuck! Jesus fucking Christ! Get out of bed! Yeah, it makes me up. Um, I usually wake up. I'm a, I'm a light sleeper, so... <laughs> After the first couple of hey, Val wakes up to like a pissed off Navi. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah, if you go to the end, it actually monitors your sleep. I hate that. There we go. Yeah, that's the thing. That's the thing because they had um, Pokemon Sleep, and it was meant to like track your sleep, and it got it all wrong. So, huh? Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, I'm but sure. Also, it also makes yeah. noise every hour. Ew. Yeah, that was the thing that just skimmed by. Hourly chimes. I hate that. Yeah. I don't yep. know. Add some play to the start of. Yeah, I don't. I don't know, man. If I want that. I'd buy a cuckoo clock, bro. <laughs> right. Like, no, I think that only does the the noon, right? Or does it do every hour? Nope, every, every hour. hour. Oh, interesting. But hmm, I don't. I don't know. Are you getting your values worth? No. I feel like it's got enough technology. Depends where... on how much you enjoy being watched, I guess. Yeah. I don't know. That's. I wouldn't personally buy it. <laughs> yeah, no, absolutely not. Interesting. All right. Cool ish product. Uh, I'm sure the internet has memed on this pretty good. I guess we'll go to the next thing. Yeah, I was just reading this before we came on. This just got released a couple hours ago, but. Apparently, what does it say here? The way Discord got started was inspired by the person that created Final Fantasy. Let's see, I think Final, like, what does it say? It says Final Fantasy 11 somewhere. This font's pretty small. Pretty old, so. So, 11 was like the MMO, and it had the worst chat system. So, obviously, you have to do like coordinated battles and all that type of stuff. So, I remember playing Final Fantasy 11 and raiding. You had to use another program. So, I we used either like TeamSpeak or Ventrilo, but I guess someone decided those programs suck because they didn't do chat, like it didn't do any text. It only did audio. So if you wanted to like share stuff in, like Discord's the gold standard now. Everyone uses Discord to my understanding. Mm -hmm. I think uh, Mishy was watching one of her streamers play Final Fantasy XI the other day and she said the graphics are horrendous. Like she didn't even watch it. She had to turn it off. <laughs> but to me, I'm like, oh, these graphics look pretty good. I don't know. I grew up with this. They're not terrible. Yeah, I, this is who I was. I was a Lala fell. I was in one of these things. Oh God, you were a <laughs> potato. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. I don't know. That's kind of oh, cool. That, that checks out actually. That you were a potato. Yeah. I don't know. I'm sure I have some info. Citrus on me is there. also a potato on Final Fantasy 14. Yeah, Lala Lala fell is 14. 14. Well. 11 is Tataru. Yeah, that's what it was. Oh, okay. Yeah. Slightly different, but more or less the same. Tataru is the name of a. a and then uh, an important Lala fell in 14. Oh, interesting. Hmm. I'm sure I passed that part of the story. I just skipped all the story. Well, she's <laughs> in the very first part arc, so yeah. Yeah, skip, skip, skip. <laughs> uh, let's see. Yeah, let's quickly go over that. That's it. And we're going to the Ikevel stuff. Anyway, we got the Ikevel event here. Well, this one's the banner, the 
the new banner? No, no, let, let's, uh, technically speaking, this is the regular banner that is constantly always up. It's just also got Halloween things in it at the moment. Oh, shit. So if so, you had saved your Eternally Cursed no. Attire tickets, you could have used them. No. I didn't know that, so I'm pissed. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't yes. know that either, because I'm assuming, yeah, this is a limited thing, right? Until you can 11. do that. Yeah, it'll come back in Halloween. You can Apparently, it's also going to be a Christmas thing as well, so hang on to it. I just throw these tickets willy-nilly. <laughs> so did I. And then I was told this, and Lucy was like, I'm sure I told you guys this. And I was like, I didn't know this. And she was like, well, you do now. And I'm like, well, I can't use them now. <laughs> Well, it's possible. Like, I get told stuff all the time. It's just, you know, sometimes in one ear, out the other. <laughs> but this stuff looks sick. Like, uh. Yeah, I've been getting the. I've been doing the paid pulls, the paid daily pulls to get the ghosts because they are making my sacrifice room look really good. Oh, uh, I don't know why. Like, Roger really stands out here. Like, to me. He really, really does. His, just... his ghost looks great with the glasses. <laughs> oh, it. yeah. He's the only one with the glasses. Who's this pouty face one on this one? I can't even tell. Is this That's color? That's Jude. I've got that one. Oh. I think it's Jude anyway. It looks like Jude. That's Slim. So hard to tell. Why is this That's one so Harry. happy? Really? The happy That's one? Harry. Still happy. Yeah. It's weird. I'm not feeling distress at all like zero percent <laughs> well that's that's not part of the event that's just a dress that's always in the oh gotcha. maybe that's why maybe i've seen it too much oh, yeah so i only took pictures of the new stuff the stuff that says spotlight is new oh interesting that's cool God, i'll get over so cute yeah it's so annoying that i've already spent my tickets though but if they oh, can no, i feel that as well Feel us. I don't feel so bad because he said it returns. Uh, hopefully, it doesn't return yeah, with more stuff. Problem. It yeah, it does. It'll, uh, there'll be more stuff. Uh, that's fine. Whatever. So don't spend these tickets at all until they have these limited time. Okay. Lesson learned. Yeah, yeah, that's lesson learned. You can also save the other gotcha tickets for the when the new boys come if you want to. I cannot. I have to use those. On. I feel like I have to. That's fair. Know. But then. I, I, I kind of fucked up because I was supposed to use it on the, the card banners, but I've been using them for the attire one because I wanted those Ita bag what the hell, dresses. Dude? What the hell? Yeah, I wanted those dresses. Like, those dresses were sick. I got like five dresses. <laughs> but these, I'm, uh, these eyes are like creepy. They're like cat eyes? Yeah, they kind of are like cat eyes. Interesting. The purple one just sounds like it looks too much. They're pretty yeah. cool, but they're not really my kind of thing. But yeah, those are the new gotcha thingies that you can get. Oh, uh, we learned something. That's all. Uh, are there what other events? There's Halloween, uh, Christmas. Is there like Christmas Valentine's? Christmas is as well? coming up. Um, I don't know if there's a Valentine's one. I mean, I guess we'll find out. But <laughs> all, all I've heard of is Halloween and Christmas. Those two. Okay, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, here's the event. Let's see, holy shit. Seeking, uh, How much of the event have you actually done? Uh, I think I finished one full route. The first day is pretty nice. It's on. It starts with a triple. Yeah, which and, JP don't get. So that's uh, nice. not only does it start with a triple, the triple goes over overlaps into the next day for yeah. a few hours. Yo, know, it's yeah. it was a good start. So I did all that. So I set my alarm for two a.m. Did all that stuff. Jesus. Still, still nine hundredth place, and I'm like, what the fuck? Would, oh my god! Who the dude. fuck? How much money are these people spending? <laughs> That's why I'm just like, bro. Yeah, to me, it, it kind of worked out fine for me because I had to sleep early that day. That was the day I had like my really bad headache. I don't know. I could not function at all. I was trying to do my dailies. It was it was worse than if I was drunk playing games. Okay, I was just like, like I I was oh, no. not having a good day. But I was like, gotta do my dailies. <laughs> gotta do my dailies. <laughs> yeah, it's bad. I I don't know. I feel like these events. I start off really bad, but as time goes on, my ranking just increases. Like people, it just tends stop doing to be it. that people go really hard at the start to get the stories, and then they just stop. Yeah, that's. I think that's what it is because I start climbing pretty to good. Get the way stories later. to get the stories and to get like the the early bonuses. 
So yeah, this this event's all about um, you drank a potion from Roger that turned you into like a, like a doll sized person. Oh, so do I they carry both of those? <laughs> the fucking. Did they carry you what around? Roger what they're saying. Yeah. Why would you want to marry a doll? Right. Uh, Lucy said, "Where did Lucy say it? Because I want to make sure that I get it right." about what people's reactions are to this event so far. Okay, the, the event reactions have been either, what the fuck is this, I'm not reading it, mm-hmm. or this is the most romantic thing I've ever read, or three, this is filth, more please. <laughs> My god. Interesting. Okay, so we have this where you're, you have the potion, you're a doll form, whatever. So what's worse, this or the anime where your right hand is a girlfriend? Oh my god. <laughs> they're um, both- <laughs> they're both pretty awful. Yeah, I think awful. a right hand girlfriend would be worse. Okay, okay, okay. Um, I would like to give a warning with this event. I know that Nat's not going to read, so it's not an issue. There was an implication in Albert's main story plotline that they're kind of into war, and that happens in the epilogue for his route. Oh, <laughs> oh fun! <laughs> Damn. Uh, that's a lot to take in. I know, maybe- That's why I'm warning. I'm like, Nat probably won't read it, so it's not an issue, but anyone else? Yeah. Or would be, will be present in Elvis Root. Interesting. Because, yeah, I don't- Sometimes I, like, when it gets, like, really spicy, I'll read a bunch, and then I'll just be like, I'm reading Harlequin or Smut. Just be like, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> feeling really hot. Gotta take off your clothes. I'm like, all right, all right, let's read some of this. All right, let's <laughs> oh fucking- <laughs> I don't know, because sometimes like the the camera like zooms in and it's like all all funny, and then each character is looking at each other, and I'm always like, they both kind of look like girls. <laughs> I don't know. That's oh my was... god! It was like when I read the the card for Ellis for the last event, I was like, oh, it's probably going to be something really innocent that he's talking about, and then I was just like, put your hands down my pants and touch me. And I was like, whoa, <laughs> whoa, <laughs> let's go <laughs> now. Uh... What are these footsteps? Is that like you in the snow? What Those are, are feathers. Oh, I thought they're like snow footsteps or something. Yeah, they're feathers. They sort of like hover around the um, the person. Yeah, I'm sure that there's. Or maybe yeah, sure... yeah, there you go. There you go. Oh, I didn't even notice that. Interesting. Hmm. Yeah, when I first saw this, I legit thought this was a different game. What do you mean? What did you think it was? No, like this. The, I don't know what it is. It, maybe it's too fairy like too bright i legit thought this was a whole different game i had to like look at it again like is this even the it give villains i'm like i don't know but it, it looks to me it looks pretty good to me but just looks like a different game very bright yeah um, yeah these are i believe these are the ranking bonuses the his outfit her outfit and the wings yeah i think the guys one's always top 200 or something yeah something like that you better get my outfit. Okay, buddy. <laughs> but I, I think I got all her dresses. Interesting. What is... Oh, this is the... the wings, yeah. But this one looks weird. It looks like... Uh, maybe it's just the way it's saved. Like the... You know how Photoshop adds in whatever. Because it looks yeah. like you have chicken pox or something. It's the pixels. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. But I think it's not part of like the real image. It's just <laughs> due to compression or whatever. Mm-hmm. Unless you do get chicken pox and that's part of the storyline. It doesn't look like she has chicken pox. <laughs> oh, wait, maybe. <laughs> I think it's due to image. Oh, no. <laughs> Imagine. I have not seen that skin in any game where he's like, you have like, you have a fever skin, you have like chicken pox skin, you have like. <laughs> uh. Maybe we should, yeah, that's a good idea. Maybe they should explore this. Oh my god. I don't think anyone would want that skin, though. I didn't think people would want feet skins, but people love these feet skins and mm. stuff. So I don't know, Listen, man. Listen, foot fetishes are a very common thing, unfortunately. It's actually scary how common it is. Yeah. I, I heard somewhere that it was like because the, the feet thing is like in your brain it's really close to like what the arousal thing so like it can easily overlap, overlap or the something like that yeah 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 it's a pretty big thing uh and i hate it yeah that's the life we live in uh when i when i see this cage 
this is like season two of SAO, and they put the. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, they put the the I, don't, I forgot her name. The female lead. She's in a cage. Um, uh, like Asuna. Her? Asuna. Yeah, yeah, maybe. Uh, Asuna. Yeah. Yeah, and then she's in this cage, and the main guy has to free her or whatever. And the, the I think the villain does like super creepy stuff. But this is what the yeah, cage I hated was. that scene. When <laughs> I saw that scene, when I because I watched that when I was a kid, and when I saw that scene, I was like, what? the hell is happening <laughs> that's that's what this this cage <laughs> reminds me of this <laughs> i am 100 percent joking before anime night we should just watch season two fuck like the yeah. first season yeah you don't even it's it's hard watch it's one of the hardest animes i had to yeah. watch i actually had to like be like skim through it and then this is the scene i watched thoroughly this this cage scene why <laughs> Yeah, it, it was different. It was this. This is a weird scene. What is this dress? All pre damn, that dress is hella nice too. Kind of reminds me of like almost Anohana a little bit better. This one has the wings. Something else. Is the wings part of the dress? The wings. The wings was the access. Is the accessory that you yeah, get in Nanking. Oh. Yeah. Fucking okay. Easy. Okay, I don't even need to do this. Yeah, that's the really easy one. Okay, that's what I wanted. The dress is really nice. The dress with the wings are like 10 of 10. I'm gonna only have the wings with a dress on. It's gonna be like 8 of 10, that's fine. Hopefully, eventually we can get it. I uh... love how the Alphonse um, doll character thing always has that skeevy looking smile. <laughs> wow. so much. It's like the villain and that's the. <laughs> <laughs> no. Sal, have you seen that scene? I heard that. The... I have. I oh, have. No. I can't believe it. Of all the shows you guys have watched, how have you both seen this? <laughs> oh, because that was a very was a like popular one. Yeah. yeah. That's when a lot of people start watching. I think after that, they were like, "I am done with this." I fucking. Yeah, yeah. When, yeah, when I, I saw it, two, I stopped for anything else. Uh, yeah. When I when I saw it, I was like, "Is this allowed?" <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sounds about right. I think I watched like season, I don't know, season five or something. Way like this gun was something. And then one of my friends like, just go back and watch season two. Just skim through it. And that's what I did. I skim through it and then I watched this, whatever. But it was weird. Like I totally just wrote it off. I was like, I'm done. It's, it's too hard to watch. Oh, what? This is where all my gems went. It's fucking Exclusive. earrings with the letters. Hmm. How are these even displayed? Like, it's, they must be super small. Uh, no, I can actually get you a picture of them. If you just give me a moment, because my character is wearing them, because I had to buy them for Ellis. And I was oh. like, um, if I had to spend this much uh, gems on this, I'm fucking wearing them. All right, let's see this. Uh, oh, the ghosts really fit. Well, that's kind of perfect. Do, they, they make my little sacrificial ring even better. I'm sacrificing Alphonse at the moment, because it keeps coming up when I'm doing my gotcha. Oh, let's go. Dude, do you have the blush on? Yeah, I have the blush and the glasses <laughs> on. <laughs> it looks so good. Looks fucking, oh yeah. This guy looks like he's gonna give him a high five. That thing looks good. Uh, what were we looking at this for again? Oh, the earrings. The earrings. Oh, earrings. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting sidetracked here. Oh, the earrings are much bigger than I thought. Interesting. They do stand so up. So in the sets, you get a letter from the person, the earrings, uh, three of those love point um, lipsticks and a closet. Hmm. Interesting. For and then for eleven hundred gems. Yeah. For some reason, I always like associate because he got he's got gloves on. You got gloves on. I almost feel like you guys are just gonna start committing some crime or something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, you would stand out with this flower braid, though. It's like they'll never find me. <laughs> I will never take that off because he gave it to me for his birthday. Ooh. For my, my yeah, for his birthday. He gave it to me. This thing looks so good though. Uh, Do you like my little house? I'm hoping that I win a Halloween prize or something. Oh, is there, is there like a contest? Apparently there are like room contests and Lucy was like, you, when I started doing my sacrifice room, Lucy was like, you'll be ready for Halloween, the Halloween one. And I'm like, cool. Oh, interesting. <laughs> uh does mc get a doll no oh, okay interesting mc gets the bird that's on him mm, interesting you know you know now that i'm thinking about it you know like you know when uh you know the tie thing you unhook the tie then it's just gonna get real I think. are you thinking about the gloves now no 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 at the the when you roll up your sleeves that's like 
<laughs> when shit's gonna get real. Maybe not sexually, but like <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Man, this shirt's not long enough, yeah. I love it so much. <laughs> I put it because I like those pants because it's got a chain and he's very he's got he wears lots of chains. And then I was I got that top and I was like, let's try it on him and it just had the sliver of tummy and I was like, this is adorable. <laughs> <laughs> it's like this is all I had in my closet. <laughs> I'm so big now. <laughs> yeah, because if you use the pants that go with that top, there isn't a sliver of tummy. Interesting. Oh, hopefully you win something. This thing, this place looks sweet. I just need more ghosts, but I keep getting Harry, so I'm thinking about putting Harry in the circle. <laughs> it's so weird. I don't know if this like your dress is meant for this room because it almost feels like perfectly collar coordinated <laughs> yeah i'm pretty happy with it at the moment your shoes look good interesting yeah they're from last event mm -hmm, interesting well no for the event before last event but yeah okay uh yeah we're done with ikebel right unless there's something else i think that's everything oh um i can also mention that that closet dealers on in the shops again so if you want like 28 closets for the price of 25 you can do that oh yeah it's a pretty good deal i'll be like i kind of want to i like i've been sitting around going i there's a part of me that wants to like play sand rock from the beginning as a dude and we're gonna do some gay unsure stuff <laughs> <laughs> let's go all right you got your got your uh goal oh, in unsure mind also has a new post-marriage quest so oh amazing <laughs> Yeah. It's like, damn, this one intense uh, train ride. Yeah, again, this is like the romance update. Unfortunately, I think this is the last major update, but. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, There's too much kissing happening wait, wait, right hold, now. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay. No, no, no. I thought this there was like. This is so cute, Nat. Do not say anything bad. This is adorable. <laughs> I thought she I... was a frog. <laughs> Oh my god. I oh my god. I wish I got the screenshot when I got to this scene. Cause like <laughs> the way the builder's hand is, like, she's like gripping Logan Studio. Oh my god. <laughs> it's so funny. Interesting. <sighs> These condoms? What? <laughs> Those are flowers. I'm like, hmm. <laughs> Damn, they're in for a busy night. <laughs> oh my God. What would you say if you saw that setup? It was <laughs> no, no flowers, bro. If they weren't flowers, though, how would you uh, react to that? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, no, they're flowers, so that's fine. Damn, does she have raccoon eyes? I was gonna say that was, that person hasn't been sleeping. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, if you stay up too late without a certain perk, that's what happens to you. That's pretty sick, actually. I like that. Yeah. Don't even need like makeup. Is this what happens when you're like wet? What is this? Um, yeah, so for well. some reason in Logan's quest, a random thunderstorm starts up, and I'm a s it's literally just for Logan had to have an excuse to take off his shirt. Oh. Okay, <laughs> it, okay. Yeah. So yeah, he's just dripping water. Okay, okay. Oh, oh yeah, cool. Justice finally has a singular romance quest. Or justice. Justice for justice. Right. Oh my god. So they they posted their reasoning behind why justice doesn't have any romance quests. I should have taken a screenshot of it. I don't know where it is now. But they're basically like, well, he's around you so much during the game. We figured it's that was not. enough. It's yeah, it's literally not. Like <laughs> You got one quest with him. Yeah. Like, sure, he's like your comp but even Unsure, who's around you, like, just as much, has fucking yeah. romance content. Mm. Actually, I would say Unsure's probably around less. <laughs> well, but Unsure at least has, like, a reverse confession, um, 
he has that letter thing. I mean, I guess he probably doesn't have to be. I mean, I'm sure is around a little bit less, but has so many quests to compensate it. Yeah. Sis already has like the shooting, and that's it. Yeah. Yeah. (laughs) This is already out, right? This came a couple days ago. It is, yeah. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Yeah, that's why I was rambling about Logan's. Like, because I played Logan's. I, I'm not married to anyone else on any of my save files that haven't been fucked up by mods, so... Hmm. How are they, are they, to... Do they still look like condoms? Yeah, 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 no, that's what I wanted. I wanted a better <laughs> image. Because from, like, top down, they do look like condoms. No, no, I'm not gonna lie. Is, there's a... The, I don't know if you guys heard about that, like, hurricane in uh, Florida. Anyways, one of the news broadcasters, they had to, like... Uh, protect their mic, so they just put a condom over their mic. And I, and I was <laughs> like, enough. that's fucking genius. <laughs> yeah, that's one way to do it. Yeah. How are they able to afford these updates, though? This is like... They'd get, they've uh-huh. gotten almost 2 million on on the Kickstarter. But, but that's well, for like, a different... I, I think that's exclusively for Evershine. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know, but what I mean is, like, they've got that just for, just for Evershine, and then they've got all the, the profits from the other two games yeah oh, true. Okay. imagine they're like well we couldn't deliver on evershine because we're at patch 2.5 in santa rock we spent all our money <laughs> yeah imagine but it looks cool yeah looks like, like i said i'm pretty sure this is the final like major content update we're getting okay I'm yeah supposed to be getting some dlc i have no idea what the fuck that's gonna be um so this is probably like roughly what they envisioned the game to be, even though it's like 1.4. That was just like, yeah, like 1.0 it. was just like playable, and then the rest of it is like yeah. they already like yeah, there's world. that additional content. Yeah, they wanted that yeah. in the game anyway. All right, uh, we'll get to the the reading aspect. It's a lot of reading. Um, yeah, we can just mostly skim over it. Yeah. Um, oh, but um, this time, so Justice only got one romance quest. Owen got two. Uh, is that good? <laughs> well, I mean, it, it's good for Owen Sims, but I'm just saying Justice deserves more. Oh, for sure. That's unfortunate. Yeah, so... um. Yeah, uh, the DLC is not available yet because of console. I'm assuming it's because of the Switch. Um, uh, let me see. Yep, yeah, yeah, yeah. Using mods, update, turn off. Hmm. So they know people are using mods for their game, and that's fine. Oh yeah, they even have like a like an um a channel in their Discord exclusively for like discussing mods, recommending mods. Weird. Wow. Even the endorsement. Yeah. Wow. Um, even in Evershine, they're acknowledging like, yeah, we hope this will be able to support mods so that players can do their own thing yeah obviously yeah, they're 100% are... pro mods. wow that's so weird yeah. let's see oh um, this yeah, is just so, all the new stuff i guess yeah so they're adding the love chronicles whatever the fuck that is eventually um the post-marriage quest uh, a new romance quest for owen the follow-up quest for miguel um after he gets out of prison um the new there's a quest with Chi and Hugo, which is where you get the um, Tree of Life sword and shield, which is actually kind of cool. Um, oh, cool. Yeah, I don't know if the two monsters are like the things that I listed. I know that the um, snake definitely is, but the other one just seems so plain. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah, that's just some like housing stuff. Um, they finally added. Um, like tiling you can put outside i don't know if you can put it inside mm, interesting. Uh, people were asking for that for a long ass time because they want to make paths and stuff it's a bus system oh um so pretty much it's um so when you build like the road to porsche um it's there's technically a bus stop there i mean you can't actually ride the bus but now you can actually see a bus going to and from that spot Oh, okay, okay. That's kind of a little bit more immersion. Yeah. Okay. Home editing, retrieval mode, and right, right. This thing looks pretty sick. Uh, Mm -hmm. 
I wish I took a screenshot of it, like, on my character. Like, the the sword is, like, glowing and it's kind of neat. Ooh, cool. The glowing part. Yeah. It already looks good. Like, you can yeah. tell. Like, the actual sword looks cool. Like, it has some weird, mm -hmm. I don't know, etching. It almost looks like a little, little tree, or like a root in the middle of the sword. That's cool. Plus, there's even water under the tree for the shield. That looks, I don't know, that's fucking sick. Yeah, I think it's sick. I mean, it's not the type of weapon I used to use, or I like to use. Yeah, and I also have combat. like the like badass post game, or not post game, very late game weapon. So, so the snake thing is the thing you fight, I guess. For um, no. So this is just a random elite enemy that you find out in the desert. Okay. Uh, okay. So. I was just reading this. It says found in. Ufaula Desert. Uh, Ufaula. Okay, okay, okay. So, 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 so that sounds fine. I'm, I'm just looking at the next one. Yeah, so these two are the ones you have to fight to get the... Or, when you enter the um, area where you get the sword above, you have to fight these things. Oh, uh, wait. Okay, from materials to make. Okay, probably? No, uh, no. no. Um, okay. There's a whole bunch of like lore stuff behind it, but it's basically some guy's workshop and he's already forged the sword or he has most of the stuff ready for it. All you have to do is really hit a button, but like these things are to quote unquote test you to see if you're truly worthy of his weapon. Uh, okay. Yeah, I just like yeah. the where you found him. It's like found in cave. It's like, bro, you got to help me a little bit more than that. But I guess <laughs> every, I guess Sandrock's only got one quote unquote cave, right? Oh sure. no, there's a bunch. <laughs> oh, that's not descriptive. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this thing's like, to me, kind of low effort because you got the blue guy here. Yeah. And this guy's literally just like a, a variation of <laughs> Yeah, so I'm assuming those two are like the snake and then the robot are the two Kickstarter ones, which uh, is really lame because, again, the robot's so generic. Yeah. That'd be sweet if you fought them both Whatever. at the same time. Oh, you do. Nice. There's like a plethora of them. Oh, okay. I thought they were like super hard and then like merged together and do all this fancy yeah, stuff. Yeah, no, it's just like a swarm of them. Interesting. I imagine if I wasn't, if I didn't play the quest, like after I beat the game, I would have struggled. Oh, hello. Oh, okay. okay. Oh, shit. I was going to be here. Am I? <laughs> <laughs> you just chill. It's just fine. It doesn't really matter. Uh, here's the tiles. Yeah. Yeah, so now we have proper flooring that you can put outside. Oh, interesting. You get 200 floorings for like 14 monies? Uh, no, that you can buy up to 200. Oh, it's but it's four, 14 each though. Yeah, unless you go with the bottom ones. Those are like from some DLC. I don't know which one. It's one that I have, so. Uh, so much cheaper though, but I guess DLC. It is, yeah. Mm. yeah. Because they're like, hey, you spend real world money. You can get this for a lot cheaper. Oh, that's fair. Oh, they have like pretty good designs. <clears throat> they're like, you have more options than the ones in Animal Crossing, but then they make it so players could design it. So there's pretty much infinite amount of stuff. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay. What do we got? Approaching its first anniversary since full release. Wow, this game hasn't been out for a year. No, not yet, but I think it's close. Wow, interesting. Yeah, it's November something. I don't remember the exact day. Interesting. Yeah, now we're getting cowboy outfits, and I don't know how I feel about them. Really? It looks, it looks good. It looks all right, but... I don't know. It looks... It looks super rugged. It looks like you would... <laughs> Uh, I don't know. Interesting. No, I like it. Uh, I think that's it for Sand Rock, right? Yep, yeah, that's all the Sand Rock stuff for now. Yeah. I'll probably update when um, we get the Chronicles or whatever, the DLC, but... Okay. Uh, what Why is... are we zooming in on this? What are you doing? What, is, what does two hearts mean? Well, what? It's like It's like a heart spinning. It's like going in a circle. Oh, and then the other one's like a celebration. Yeah. So I, I just never seen it before. 
go to Evershine stuff. There's quite a bit of Evershine stuff, I think, too. It's a halfway yeah. point of Kickstarter. Oh, for the date? Did they set an end date for this? They did, yeah. It's only for a month. Wow, that's I not think that it ends long. October 24th. Yeah. Yeah, that's why it's especially impressive that they managed to get 1 million within 26 hours. Yeah, so... They could technically still hit the two million, maybe, right? Unless they are at, I don't think so. I don't much. think they are. I'm just yet. checking it. Let me check oh. it right now. Um, but yeah, I posted this because I thought it was interesting because they're like, um, if we make this much money, we won't have to do early access. I didn't realize that early access was a negative thing. Oh, they're very close. They're at one million nine hundred thirty-three thousand six hundred eighteen. Oh, hmm. Interesting. So, sorry, what was if they reach the whatever, they don't have to do how much? Is yeah, it? so they reach 2.5 million. They won't have to do early access. So what what is like early access? It's kind of like a beta test where you're kind of just bugging, um, free bugging, debugging, I guess. Well, I guess you're just you're just playing the game early, like while it's still like not polished, not complete. OK, um, so if they got 2.5 million. They can just do all that on their end. Yeah, and they won't have to do, um, yeah, they won't have to. <laughs> mm. I, I kind of wonder, because I'm like, maybe people would find that as a perk, though, for like a player, you know, see it in like the rough edges and you can kind of yeah, put like, in your I, feedback. Yeah, because like, again, I thought early access was supposed to be like a teaser kind of thing. I didn't realize like it's a necessity for certain games and mm. like they, um, I guess need to do it to make a little bit more money for the final product. Ah, here, yeah, they get funding and feedbacks, yeah. So obviously, yeah. if you, you get so much money, do they not need the feedback because they got the money? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I'm assuming they'll probably get enough feedback with like the like alpha slash beta players, but ah, uh, see, with enough money, they'll have a couple extra months of development time. I guess so. Mm -hmm. Last crunch. Yeah, because, um, like, when I was playing Sandrock Early Access, like, um, there was constantly, like, a thing up at the top of the screen that was, like, this does not reflect the final quality, and then, like, they just straight up warn you, like, hey, this character does not have much content. So. Okay, so initially, uh, their goal was, like, what, 200k, 300k or something? Uh, it, I remember it being, like, super low. They said they hit yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, for Evershine, uh, it was only like um, 200,000. Yeah, they said they hit it in 35 minutes. So yeah. <laughs> let's just say, like, theoretically, they can make the game uh, with the 300,000. And all the down here says it's like less crunch for the team if they can hit like X amount of money, like more money, less pressure on the team. So at 200, mm -hmm. like, let's say 300K, are they working like on ramen noodles, sleeping at the office, maximum pressure? Like, what? <laughs> What is this? Yeah, I have no idea. Because, yeah, at the top they said, um, uh, where is it? Um, they were expecting, oh, there we are. Somewhere between Sandrock's 500,000 and a million dollars. Ah, it's good that they can have so a little bit. Their expectations were low. It's hard to say, though, because you don't know how much. Hen like how many extra fans you're gonna get it seems like they got a lot of new fans with this game because what this is sand rock they did porsche first so they probably expect the same amount of growth but i guess it kind of snowballed per se because he threw it on game pass too and then it apparently did pretty well on game pass that's our logic we reach because we're tremendous beneficial something something I'm, I'm not reading this correctly project help us blah 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 uh, yeah they're pretty much just saying like hey help us reach our goal so we don't have to do early access. Hmm, okay. Um, swimming feature. Yeah, uh, so the stretch, couple of stretch goals were we can finally swim now instead of just stepping in the water and dying instantly. Um, and then the hot spring play date. Uh, or like just hanging out. Yeah, this is definitely worth it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's, fucking, that's pretty funny. This is a good, interesting. Uh, you guys have far exceeded this goal anyway, so that's cool that oh, they yeah, put this yeah, in the game already. 
I don't know how the swimming will work, but um, it looks fluid-ish. Yeah, so it looks like, um, I think I saw them saying that they're trying to figure out, like, how to make your companions, like, keep up with you. <laughs> so they're not, like, awkwardly, like, glitching behind you and trying to keep up. Yeah, you know, in some games, like, something's, they'll kind of just stand upright and kind of get, like, forced to you, kind of, <laughs> like, slide towards you. And not, like, you know, swim towards you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so they're trying to figure that out right now. Oh, um, I said no. multiplayer, so yeah, that's even another layer of all this. Yeah, so in Sandrock multiplayer, um, you were like trying to build the town in a really weird fucking way, and it wasn't that good. Um, but for this, it's basically main game, but you can play with multiple people. But the oh. only downside is um, if you guys all want companions, you can't all have companions. You can only have four total, so like one person gets a certain amount, then like another person would get less. Oh, okay, on screen at one time for like RAM or whatever yeah. purposes. It's probably to accommodate the Switch. <laughs> like yeah. realistically. That's kind of cool though, because the Sandrock, the way it worked to my understanding is uh, if you want to play multiplayer, it was just a whole different game. Like it Pretty was, much, yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, the originally the original plan for Sandrock multiplayer was it took place in the past. And then you got like a little bit more lore about that. But now it's just a weird timeline of modern Sandrock. Because they didn't have enough resources to finish it. Yeah, I think it's like better this way, because like if you design your house in uh, Evershine, at least people will be able to see your house properly. Mm -hmm. Let's see total followers, like you said. Yeah, money you'll have shared. A, I think you, yeah, shared money, which is fun. Uh, um, yeah, I don't know about that because uh, <laughs> uh, items are shared. Uh, <laughs> uh, oh, I don't like this. <laughs> yeah, I think unless it's like something in your personal inventory, like you will have like this shared chests or whatever. Yeah, I don't know. From my I, understanding. I, I'm personally never played a game where I share resources, but I yeah. I know of my coworkers and stuff where their kids spend all their currency and spend all their ore, spend all their shit. Yeah, that would probably drive me nuts. <laughs> <laughs> this building aspect, this is the thing that's got me the most hype because the building looks pretty sick. Um, so players will no longer be the builder, instead act as governors. Let me see. So would you well, hire? How come we're not the builder, but we're building? <laughs> <laughs> I think, um, if I remember correctly, from like what um, Gotti was saying, um, basically builders become governors, or like that's usually who, who they look for. So you're technically just an upgraded builder. <laughs> Can you imagine if that was the real world? <laughs> just like, let's oh get God. the builders in. You know, it kind of. It is realistic in a sense that when you take on a well, new role, yeah. you just get, you do your same job and more. <laughs> yeah. uh, you're responsible for way more. And, oh, man. Mm. At least that's cool. From you can still build it. Um, it's basically... Oh, um, the vibe I'm getting is it's kind of like Animal Crossing, but not cutesy. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, in the in yeah. chippy, like yeah, yeah, it is cutesy yeah, like the town too. Yeah, building aspect and like. Yeah, it still looks cute in its own. It has its own like. Aesthetic. Yeah, it has its own charm, but it's yeah. not like you know the Animal Crossing like cutesy style. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's even weather. Is there weather in uh, Sandra? Aside from sand, <laughs> like sandstorm. Yeah. Yeah, they have like the sandstorms. They have rain, but like I think all of my save files are glitched. Because I only get the rain during, like, the event where they introduce the concept of rain. I've never gotten rain after that. Hmm. It's supposed to be rare, but not that rare. Um, it also snows during the winter. Does it snow I remember the one time it rained. I remember the one time it rained for me. I was like, oh, you, I had, like, no rain catches. And I was like, you fucking kidding me. And then when you got them all ready, it never rained again. Well, and Val was like, so you should be on your rain catches all day today because of all the rain. And I'm like, I don't have, I only have like two. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just mostly a lot of yapping. I just included all of it. Yeah. This image here really reminds me of like, kind of like Fortnite. 
Oh god, yeah. Where are we dropping, boys? <laughs> <laughs> like, it really looks like this, I don't know. As you can see, art style is more realistic. Yeah, yeah. See, a higher quality smut. Yeah, that's good shit. Oh, oh, <laughs> money, the money went up a little bit. Oh, nice. I'm pretty sure they'll hit the 2 million. It's just like... They got 12 days to... Oh, it went up again. <laughs> they got 12 days to get about 70 grand. Yeah, that's, so, that's, that's not hard. Doable. Yeah. Depending how many packages they have left. Let me see. Well, I wonder what you else. You can just straight up do it without a reward, so... Yeah. But it's more fun if you get a reward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Since you can do other activities in the pool, I wonder, like, what other activities they're looking towards. I don't know. Yeah, I just thought it was so funny that because of Ragnar being topless so often, they, have, they might have to raise the age rating. I didn't even think that would be a thing. Hmm. But there's already, like, animated... Like, what is the rating? Let's see. Yeah, there's only um, two packs, and they're the, like... Yeah, there's only two packs that have, like, run out of them. Oh, uh, okay. Just at the very top or whatever. One's a $20 one, which is very Weird. strange to me. And the other one is a $2,500 one. Okay. Uh, one very low, one pretty high. <laughs> there's still one left for anyone who wants to spend $10,000. Ooh. Maybe. Me. That's the one that I has the NPC review and stuff. Yeah, I could have sworn that one was sold out. Maybe someone cancelled their pledge. It says one left of two, so... Yeah, yeah, I thought it was completely sold out, but... Yeah, I feel like even if they up the rating, 12 plus is still super, like, low, because they're still fighting but in this. Yeah. So, I'm yeah. like... But again, it's it's funny that Ragnar and his titties <laughs> yeah, like, are raising the age rating. His optical illusion titties. Yep. Do not understand those titties. They are... I, want, I would like to understand those titties, but I will never understand those titties. Uh, it's got nice shorts. Well, that's all I'm looking at. Looks just like a regular dude. A he's, got that he's got that good V line on the hips. Oh, is there? Oh, okay. You're right. I don't know what we're supposed to be looking for. <laughs> it's like a V line on the hips. Interesting. Okay. I guess we noticed, I noticed that on like some animes, like uh, in Free, where they're super like fit. Yeah. But what I need is a happy trail. <laughs> <laughs> that would make this character for me if you had a happy trail. All right. Uh, why, are, why are all the men outfits here that I'm looking at? Every man is wearing thongs. Um, or yeah, flip flops if you're American. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because I'm like, thongs, they look like shorts. No. <laughs> that's what I need. That's Every what time, I as I, said it, as I said it, I was like, I'm going to need to explain like, this one because in Australia we call those thongs. I was like, is there something behind Not this? Not to do fan art. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. But I don't know. Like, what's wrong with... It looks fine. Like, they don't have socks on or anything. Yeah, it's, it's, it's interesting, thongs. though. I hate thongs. Oh, do you? Interesting. Yeah. Okay, which part of... What don't you like about them? Like, so I tried to wear them once and they were just very uncomfortable. Who wears them? Like, that's really <laughs> uncomfortable. But maybe there, there's like two different, there's like predominantly two different sizes, like two different styles. One that goes in your big toe, which I can understand that's annoying for some, but they have the one that like just goes over your foot. You don't like I either? I think those are- yeah, I don't like the ones, I don't like the ones that go over your foot, but I, they're, I, they're, I don't call them thongs. Um, because so, they just uh, slip right off. Okay, are those technically sandals in Australia? I, too? I, call, I call them slippers. I'd consider, I'd consider them, yeah, I consider them like sandal slippers. Holy kind of shit. Thing. Okay, so the thong is the thing that goes in your toe. Yeah. Okay, much like the other thong. Just in there. <laughs> Interesting, okay. Maybe that's why we call them thongs. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, the designs look really cool. This yeah, Avery one looks like an old man. <laughs> kind of looks yeah, Avery old. Just constantly looks. Avery just constantly looks grumpy. Yeah. Interesting. Look, the, dude, the stream is gone. By the way, Nat. Oh, interesting. <laughs> I wonder why that closed. I heard Nat say, "Oh yeah, it kind of," and I'm like, "Nat." <laughs> I wonder why it closed. I didn't. I yeah, know I you know. did that. Yeah, I thought that was on purpose. No, no, no. No, 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 I just changed the image. It's weird that it crashed. Oh. 
Interesting. Yeah, he looks like him. <laughs> I'm not saying that he himself looks like him. I'm saying the what he's wearing makes him look like an old man. Yeah. Yeah, I get old man vibes as well. I mean, we know that Avery, he's a he's a kind of a dick, but <laughs> I'm still gonna romance him. <laughs> Fair. I love that Tia looks like she's got some curves. Yeah. Um. Just a little. Barely. Just a little. Yeah. A yeah, little. just a little. Just just a hint. Yeah, and the, the, the problem is every game I'm playing now, every character's like, they took the thickness and they dialed that shit to like fucking 11. Every character's well, no, I'm not talking, I don't want like, I'm not saying big boobs. I'm yeah. saying she's not looking like a stick. Yeah. Oh, yeah, she got, she's got a hip. Yeah. yeah, I'm just saying every game, they got too much hip. <laughs> I'm yeah. playing, uh, so that's, this looks like a regular figure to me. <laughs> this looks good. It's like it's not trying to sell to DJs. <laughs> That's what I'm yeah. saying. Uh, they look yeah, the only for... like selling to DJs is with the men. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think they're they know their audience. Yeah, I like how Freya's actually not looking like she's gonna kill us. Yeah, oh, Freya's yeah. like actual art is so cute, but her in-game model they like fucked up so bad. I think it's just her face i don't know what yeah, it is yeah, yeah it is is there any like backstory with victor like we know nothing we about know. he now we've learned that victor is just a, a, a an outfit yeah that's all he yeah. is interesting uh, okay but yeah we maybe know he's about invisible victor. maybe he's the invisible man oh my god uh <laughs> well apparently he like physically appears on the mouse pad so Okay, I'm gonna need to see this mouse pad. Oh, well, again, they haven't released it because they haven't released what Victor looks like. God damn it. Yeah. Again, oh. we don't know what Victor looks like at all. If I did, I would show you. And if it's one of those hush hush things, I'd still maybe show it and just mm. tell you guys to hush hush as a joke for obvious reasons. That, that, that for, be... for legal reasons. <laughs> yeah, for legal reasons, that is a joke. Very attractive. She is. Yeah, all the yeah, TV stuff. For some reason, for some reason, I just I don't know where I read it, but I don't know. Like it might have been. I must have imagined it, but for some reason, in my head, it was that Ragnar and Panna were both hunters and they like worked together. Mm. Uh, I, like, I tried to look for. I tried to look for it and I couldn't find it. And I'm like, where did this come from? You're writing fanfic automatically. You don't even realize what? it. <laughs> to me. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. Uh, what is this? Did they just release just extra art like this? Um, so one of the stretch goals was um, the... Sorry, I'm trying to find um, something else on Ragnar. Um, but one of the stretch goals was like all the like core romanceables get pajamas. So like that they change into at night. Oh, that's why they look like. I'm like, what is going on? Like, I didn't know that was the whole theme. That makes sense now. Um. Oh, Ragnar is an adventurer, apparently. Oh. Uh, maybe Victor doesn't sleep. That's why, like, when he nighttime, he disappears. Oh my god! <laughs> I, I don't know. This like, is his pajamas. He's never worn them. <laughs> they're so nice. They look brand new. <laughs> Maybe that's what it is. I'm looking at previous art of Ragnar and Panna, and they both have the same strap on their arm. Maybe I'm just, maybe I put two and two together. I don't know. Mm. <laughs> maybe yeah, because we don't actually know that much about like don't, yeah, we don't know much about any of them really. I mean, we know a little bit about Avery because he appeared in Sandrock, and he also appeared in the comic. Um, Tia, we know nothing about Freya. We know nothing about Victor. We definitely know nothing about. Hannah, we know a little bit about, and then Ragnar, just little snippets of like. Ragnar sounds like a, a himbo because he's never wearing his clothes. <laughs> You're right. I think you guys know a lot about Ragnar already. Oh, <laughs> listen, yeah. I don't understand his titties, and it upsets me. <laughs> well, you don't have a side image of him, do you? Yo, we had one previously where he was like leaning against a wall with the person. Hang on, I'll look it up. And this is like what the, I'm, this is why I'm like I don't understand. 
A little bit of titty. He's got a little bit. Ah, uh, looks pretty buff to me. Mm -hmm. But not as much as like he should have for that amount of muscle structure. So one of those you're gonna have to feel this one out. Here's another one. Hang on. Oh, also, um, according to the main artist, um, for lore reason, or Ragnar used to have longer hair, but for lore reasons, he cut it shorter. How dare you! <laughs> I'm not okay with that. See, this is another front on, but it's all- He looks flat! He looks a little bit more flat here. He's flat! And then you can look at the picture of him without it, and it's like, he doesn't look flat. And it's- What happened? What's happening? <laughs> yeah, you're right. He's you're a right. That bit. also might be like an earlier render. They might have like- <gasps> Did they the fix the up. titties? Did they fix <laughs> the titties? <laughs> yes, he's a little- Proportion's a little bit off, but he looks- Pretty, yeah. Hmm. It does look okay. different too. Like it looks like there's less. Uh, I don't know. It looks like less detail. It looks like more. <laughs> I don't know how you put it. Like this is less detailed. Like this one looks less detailed. I mean, like, the other one looks like with more, way more shadows and stuff. Who knows? If they fix his titties, I'll be so happy. So they said, what, it's not too far off, this, what, like, when you get alpha, it'd be, what, six months, eight months? I have no idea. Hmm. I just realized that I was yelling about titties that my parents are upset. <laughs> <laughs> well, you could show them, and they would probably be upset, too. They'd be like, that's I'd not I'd be like, look at these, look at these optical illusion titties. It's like, oh, Thank what did God. you talk about with your kid yesterday? Well, we were discussing man titties. You know, they just weren't the, <laughs> they weren't the same. They were different. <laughs> They're pretty close, but yeah, they are slightly different. But I guess it could I'm be so different. I'm so upset about that hair thing, but I just... <laughs> yeah, well, okay, so I misremembered. I could have sworn it was because of, like, in-game lore reasons. But I found a message about his hair. Apparently, there's another long-haired character we will meet. I wonder if it's Victor. How I dare you? <laughs> right? You're gonna have to split I'm your. So upset. I the longer the hair, the better. Right. I literally have been looking at him, going, "The only thing that would make him better would be longer hair." And they cut it. Yeah, you're I'm gonna have so to. So upset. You're gonna have to start I'm, I'm, Twitter I'm hashtag. obviously fixing. Obviously, also fixing the titties, but uh, yeah. But everything else is fine. The feet are fine. The hands are fine. Everything else is fine because, like, I don't want him to have a dump truck, but I want him to have <laughs> big titties. Yeah, <laughs> titties are important. I concur. Yeah, I concur. <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll end on that note. That's a solid message. Um, <laughs> you guys, have anything else? <laughs> No, well, I think I, I think I've said enough. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, you want to lead us out, Val? Give us money. Okay, thanks. Bye.